Hello, my name is John Colucci. And I am 49 years old, living in Waterbury, Connecticut. I am married and have one daughter. I'm making this video to warn everyone out there about Diamond Resort International. They stole my money through Timeshare. In 2014, my wife and I were on vacation in Virginia Beach, and we bought a beach quarter timeshare. This was through Golden Key Resort. Gold Key was later taken by Diamond. A sales rep offered us some uh, show tickets if we would attend a short presentation for an hour. That's what they said. They started out being very nice to offer us breakfast and lunch. But then they became very pushy and they would let, not let us leave for not three hours. We felt that the only way we could get out of there is to sign the timeshare. I'm sure that we would not normally qualify for a loan to buy a timeshare. However, in order to make sure that we did qualify, the sales rep got us to write false information. They told us to stay, that our income was $50,000 and when it's, it was not. They told us that, this, that we were homeowners when we're not. They made us obtain uh, credit fraudulent instance. This beach quarter timeshare does not match up to what the reps told us. They told us many lies. They said that timeshare was a real estate and it would go up in value. Therefore, they said that we could sell it later and make a profit. But we now know that timeshares were almost nothing. And the main point of having the timeshare is able to take a vacation. But we were shocked to find out that we needed to pay 184 hours to international, Interval International in order to able to book anything. The reps had not told us anything about this. We didn't pay this fee once. But even then, we were not able to use, the, use it because we were, couldn't find anything within our price range. The reps told us that uh, owning a timeshare would give us all the, these great vacations. But now we have found out we also pay for the vacations separately. This is on top of the fees and the mortgage. It, may, it makes uh, you wonder at what is the point of joining the timeshare in the first place. Because of this, we were never able to afford any vacation. The whole thing is, was a waste of money. As I said before, in 2015, Diamond uh, took over the timeshare key business of Gold Key. Sometimes after this, I realized that Gold Key had lied to us. So we complained to the Diamond and the current owner. Diamond admits that Gold Key is no longer in business, so Diamond knows that he cannot appeal to Golden Key. But Diamond also says that it's not responsible for actions of Golden Key before it brought, bought Gold Key. But logically, Diamond still expects us to pay the loan and fees of the contra uh, contract signed before, it, before uh, Golden Key. Now it does not make sense. They can't have it both ways. If Diamond bought a uh, uh, gold key and it fees like they should receive the loan payments, then they need to take care of the problems that arises with these X gold key properties. Anyways, I just wanted to make a video so that the people would be aware of Diamond are up to. My advice is steer well clear of Diamond Resort International. Thank you.